video games and summer camps? Advocates say they could spawn a whole new generation of code-savvy graduates to meet employers' demands. Coding camps for kids are an increasingly popular effort to inspire children and teens to seek technology careers. The Bureau of Labor Statistics says jobs for network and computer administrators are growing at double the national average, with a median annual salary of $69,000. There's not enough people currently for all the jobs that we have in computer science, so we've got to grow interest. Uh, second reason is anything over the age of seven is, it can, is capable. Hadi Partovi founded Code.org. The nonprofit pushes schools to expand or increase programming classes. He says less than 5% of U.S. high school students learn computer science. Well, it's a graduation requirement in China. Still, Partovi says coding camps aren't just for techies. But it could mean you're a doctor and you're tired of entering the same data into a chart using paper and you want to write an app that does it for you. Ten-year-old Eric Weiss is not yet thinking about his future career, but he is preparing for it. It's not the age, it's how much you practice at it and go at it. Seventeen-year-old Kayla Clancy is the oldest and only female camper at her coding camp. It's part of our society today. It's really growing and it's it's important. Like every technology is used for everything, and coding is used for every type of technology. Experts estimate there will be 1.4 million computing jobs by 2020, but only 400,000 U.S. computer science students at that time. Coding camp advocates say it's time to get coding. Naya Hawkins, Associated Press.